hello and welcome to another video you will know already what happens from the title of this video and uh, we don't lose the time anymore i have here these two programmers i promise you last time we'll make a comparing between these two i was quite surprised with the vnci how fast he communicated with the car okay and i said i must do this video and this is exactly what we'll do we'll compare these two diagnostics i will leave a link in the description below for both of them you can buy from wherever you like to buy it, but I put this one because you are asking me all the time if I have a seller, what I can trust it. This is exactly what I will do. I will put a link in the description below from the seller from where I buy this one and from where I buy another one, okay? You can buy from wherever you like to buy it. It's up to you, as I said, okay? I will start first with the V6. We'll connect to the car and we go from there. Not so fast, I forgot to mention you. I have two laptops there. Both of them come with Intel 7 generation. Both of them have 8 gig of RAM. One is from ThinkPad, one is from Dell. Okay, I'm on Lenovo and Dell. They are almost the same. Both of them have the NVMe and 8 gig of RAM. So I will plug the VCX. Let's plug the VCX. Or let's do something different. Let's take the laptop first and see how fast it can read the V number okay because I will plug on the USB and I will leave you here to see how fast it is Okay, just straight it was really quick okay let's start the diagnostic I'll put also a timer on the screen but not now I must select first the car okay we have all this data when you don't have connection here you should know your VCI try to uh, change to DO IP. Okay, it tell me I don't have the license. I can use it two times. The VNCI doesn't have these things. I mean, you can use it without renew the license. I forget to renew the license, but anyway, I still use it two times. I will give okay. Okay, let's start the diagnostic. Three, two, one. This video is more for curiosity because both of the programmer should make the same work. Actually, it doesn't matter one is faster, one is slower. Most important, it is what he can uh, bring to you. which performance you have. In my case, for example, the VCX, it have uh, all this license, then of course I don't, I will never change it for VNCI because they don't have a product with all this license. For, or at least I don't uh, know for this uh, kind of product. The VCX also, it doesn't disappoint me till now. And I'm quite happy with him. It, it have also a few issues on BMW cars with E-Series. Not with all these cars want to communicate with the transfer case with VTG. It was really good, really fast. Now we don't lose the time. I will go out. I will don't uh, save this one, I don't want to clear nothing, just go out. Okay, I'm finished with VCX. Let's put it there. Now also let's 
try to plug this one. I am like a small child when Santa Claus come to him with these gifts for the Christmas time. Okay. I will try also to show you here. If you can see something because of this shitty glare. I have the sun on my face, I can do nothing about this. Okay, it's connected. I do believe the um, VC it was a little bit faster finding the VIN number, but this doesn't matter. It, they are almost the same. Okay, same procedure, 3, 2, 1, and let's start. You can leave me a comment below and tell me which one you like it more. The VNCI is much cheaper. But now it depends for what uh, purpose you want to use it. If you want to use it for more cars and more brands, then the, of course you should go for VNCX. It was also amazing fast. I don't know what should I tell you. I forget another one to to check the issues communication, but I know for sure it doesn't have problem. Also, this programmer with uh, modules on VAC company, it doesn't have problem. Now it's up to you which one. You decide to buy it which one you like it more I don't suggest you to buy this one or another one it's just my opinion if you want to stay only for VAC company go for that one for VNCI for this one because it's much cheaper if I don't make a mistake this one it's around 100 euro and that one it's around 150 160 euro only for VAC company license on this one you don't must to renew the license it's also not pain in the ass because for this one you must to renew the license every two months on the internet both of them they are uh, till 2030 and uh, it's up to you which one you like to buy which one you you prefer more okay i hope this video it was interesting for you like always i will tell you thank you for watching and see us to next one bye bye